like thunder. You'd be a thundercat. This is, uh, oh! I mean, physically, look, I have a regular sized man's hand. It's like, it's like the entire neck just for a hand. So I'm kind of guessing that Stephen Thundercat Bruno has got enormous hands, gigantic feet, and very popular with the ladies. Um, he just started a rumour, bro. What else? This and he's saying Gary Willis doesn't. Well, he's a white guy, isn't he? So he probably doesn't. Oh, no. Um, bare scratched finish on some semi acoustic bases. That kind of cool. Looks nice, man. Yeah, I, 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 am, I am kind of. This is sick. Converting. Do this yellow thing. I really like that. Gerald Beasley. That just looks beautifully made. That's, That's the, the face, ultimate bass player the face, face of feel. Yeah. He's so in the pocket there. That's yeah. so, um, so. I'll just have to squeeze by him. Oh, this, oh, yeah, you're not wrong. This is BTB, isn't it? I always kind of thought BTB was a slightly sort of crazy shape body. Just really, really long extended horns. I would feel, you know, like I think it's really great. It's like, I would rather be that. Yeah, And they should have done it black on That's a big mistake. Yeah. See, what's the... That looks sick. I kind of think it does, but... It, but oh, I just want to touch I it. Mean, if you play... I mean, obviously, you, you... I don't know. I mean, I'm not a bass player, but clearly once you get past the 11th fret, it kind of forces you to play almost like a classical style. In the back of that. It's kind of funky. That's really nice. I wonder if it's done for balance, maybe, or just... I think you might be right. pretty well balanced. It's just more, more a defensive area for fighting off people on stage. That's beautiful. Yeah. We should find out what wood that is. Oh my god. That looks great. I have great. no idea, oh, but it looks it. stunning. I really like that. Yeah, that's that's stunning. So this is all SR series. You guys are probably familiar. SR series has been like the best-selling baseline in the world for a while now. Just tons of new colours, really. So that kind of glossy grey, the sort of the browny kind of metallic, the blue fade sunburst. Loads of cool new colours, and again, all incredibly affordable. All around about the three hundred pound mark for an SR three hundred. Uh, what else we got? Some flame top ones over the other side. Oh, they've got my favourite wood. Let's go look at that one. Oh, oh I love it. See, if I was a bass player, this is the kind of thing I think I'd want to play. If I could It looks like embodied spirits. It does, doesn't it? It's really nice. I, I'm going to take a guess that something like this would be about seven or eight hundred pounds in the UK. Just really nice and finished. Again, Indonesian made. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, sir, I am. This is too bad. Yeah, I don't know. What kind of band would you be in to play that? Like a Kiss tribute band or something like that. But. Um, Oh no, apparently this is a Mike D'Antonio signature bass, so I'm guessing you'd be in his band if you were going to play that particular guitar. You know, it's all about the bass. All about the bass. No trouble. Oh, sorry. Oh. Uh, about the bass. Have, uh, you know that kind of crazy shape, not crazy, but that Tolman shape that I was kind of saying to you, some years I like it and some years I don't? The whole range of bass guitars in that same kind of shape. So, um, there we are. A little bit of old, a little bit of new, a little bit oh, of fans, a little bit of Erica in I love your face, a little bit of bass guitar in uh, your video. Yeah, these are pretty, aren't they? Again, I love the use of all the laminate woods. Um, yeah, there you go. I'm not entirely sure if I'm qualified to tell you, bass players, what's good and what's not, but I did my best. That's nice. Look at this one. I like that. I like the. Do I like that? Yeah, I think I like that. I liked it from a distance. Yeah, and now I'm close enough. I like it up, less. I'm not so sure that I like it as much. But that would be okay as long as you always played in a band where there was like a regulation distance. Or if you had a really long strap. Yeah. So yeah. you could look 
yeah. from far You would away. have to have a sign, don't stand within Anywhere near six space. feet yeah. of this base. <laughs> it looks great. You know, I think we descended into talking just ridiculous rubbish. I think we might. Okay. Um, is that Ivan is done? I really hope you've enjoyed watching these videos. So do I. We're near the end of day one. I sincerely hope that. Um, yeah. It's going to get better. I, I promise you. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye.